Right, we've got one ultra scale wheel mounted in the step jerk, and we're going to take off the face by 0 0.2 of a millimeter. So all I'll do is fire this up. should be done. I'll uh, just run this over it to clean it up. The next job is to mount the wheel on the arbor, which is basically a tapered eighth axle, which I need to screw on to Get it in the whoops, missed out the washer. Now I've actually screwed it up with the washer in place. Now there's some holes in the back. I need to line those up with the spokes or the gaps in the spokes so that we can put some pins in to hold. Trying to get them in without pushing it through the. Uh, that's it. Now we've set it all up in the thing. I've put two pins in. We've got this, the washer in, and it's all tight. We slot this into the mandrel, uh, the collet, and we'll just set the tool up. all done at the moment by eye. So, taking a thin slither off there. off the back. We need to clean that up with a file because we're running on the spokes here there's a little bit of chafe in it. Let's run the file along the back yeah that's better. Now we need to take the flange down uh, it's a pre pre-done size so up with a file. Now we're going to change, we're changing the tool post and we're going to put in the form tool. So we'll slot that into position. It's already been height adjusted. So I now need to adjust it to where the wheel where it fits over the wheel itself. And this is done by eye to start with on the back so we push it up and it fits into the slot. 
Uh, if we just move it round, you'll feel it bite. Now push that in until it touches the tyre. You, you can tell it touches the tyre because the sound changes when when it hits. So that's the wheel done. Now we've taken out the wheel. Uh, it's still on the man the arbor. I just need to push that off. And we'll take out the form tool. Oops, the wrong way. And offer the two up together, and they should fit in perfectly. Uh, I already knew that they did. So that's one double O wheel converted to B four.